All right, let's tie up a couple election loose ends, updating you on a couple of folks that we reported on during the lead up to the election. Remember this? First up, James Hebe. Remember him? This is body camera footage from the sheriff's deputies called to the Clackamas County Fair on August 17th. That's State Representative James Hebe. Well, it's in the shirt that says Hebe. He said that he'd been drinking that night and refused to put out a cigarette at the fair. He was eventually arrested by the deputies, but later the district attorney decided not to press charges. Hebe is the person who replaced Christine Drazen when she stepped down from the legislature to run for governor. In the most political races, that arrest would be the end of a candidate's political future. They'd be done. They would drop out. They would uh, either be pressured by their party to do it or they would do it on their own, but either way, they'd be gone. And I did hear rumors shortly after that arrest that he was going to drop out of the race and work on some personal issues. But guess what? Nope. He hung in there. And it looks like he is now on his way to re-election. According to the Secretary of State's office, Heap has 16,126 votes. His Democratic challenger, Walt Trandum, has 8,605. I guess that goes to show it's true what they say. All politics is local. And the locals like James Heeb, despite that night at the county fair.